Hello friends, I'm Erfan Hussain. I'm just going to talk about how to make website totally free without investing any kind of amount of money. Okay, how to do it? How to make a website or blog? totally free for lifetime okay so to starting to make website before starting to make to create web site or blog what you should have what you first number one you should have email address okay if you don't have email address I'm just going to tell you how to make how to create email address how to make email address for you okay just I'm going to make email address by using Gmail just write Gmail now if you want to create new email address then please click to more option then click to create account now write your name I'm just going to tell my name and just it's my name make website free two thousand twenty one and I have already got this name and first word ma one two three four five six just copy this one but i'll tell you that you have to use the like this password you have to how can you make a strong password this password is not uh, strong just check this one too short fear that means it's uh, as well as it's okay but not this password is on safe to keep safe to keep your account for lifetime so if you want to um, if you want to set up a strength password so you have to follow my instruction first you have to write ma give it a small letter then now write capital letter again and just write some symbol at the rate of star mark then write numeric something one two three four five six but this is not uh, good for you just write some four four five five six six okay then going to copy this password now select this again this password is strong so any doesn't anyone that doesn't break this password to hack your account now i'm going to copy uh, first this again now january 
February 01 and 202 okay just uh, 99 gender male and write your the mobile number okay I'm just going to write my mobile number yeah tell <coughs> zero one six three two three eight nine seven four three then uh, if you have any current email address then type this email address here or France you seven zero okay write your email address in here you have to uh, input your current email address what you have already okay just i'm going to write my current email address and then location you have to select your location if you are from bangladesh then you have to select this one if you are from any country that means australia then you have to choose this one okay then click to next option after that and you have to uh, scroll down then click on the click on the i agree button okay after a while you will see the another page now you have to uh, confirm your email address what you have to do already your email address already has been created just try just i'm going to save my email address what i have this is my email address just uh, write your email address something you have to uh, save if you uh, lost if you lost your uh, if you lost any time if you lost your account how you can recover this one i'll suggest you at first just write creation date creation date of email address okay today uh, 16th uh, jo uh, august 2007 just write 16th august 2007 2017 and you can also write the uh, your time 03 and 03 00 05 m and write your uh, birth date date of birth first february 2990 okay now we are going to set up this option Mm, click to my account I have set up just going to uh, gmail.com my email address already has been created now we have crossed number one option I have already email address number two Let's choose uh, choose your title keyword and meta description
google adwords planner you can use this one okay i'm just going to uh, if you uh, want to use this google adwords planner tool you must have account on gmail already i have an account on gmail so i can use this one just uh, type google then first then copy this name charts here I click on this option adwords.google.com slash home slash tools slash keyword dot trainer okay this previous name was like this previous name name was keyword research tool This uh, keyword research tool and is the same uh, is the alternative name to Google AdWord Planner tool. If you don't have account on Google AdWords, then you have to uh, make like this. Make one. Already, I want to sign in. I want to sign in with my Gmail address, so I'm going to click on sign in option. now write your password which you have in your gmail address okay then click to next button okay this is loading please wait for a few seconds we why you are going to use this option google uh, adware tool planner tool is very important to source a good uh, optimization uh, SEO friendly title meta description keywords etc okay if you have any um, website then you can write I'm just uh, write my website name coxbadgertech.com then click to continue button I'm going to uh, tell you how to set up actually uh, how to set up your Google AdWords planner tool account Uh, loading actually we have to wait for a few seconds okay number three there yeah, we until uh, we we can wait for the time okay it's loading now it's working please wait um, until this is completed When you have successfully logged in in your Google AdWords account, then you will see some menu, some category, home, campaign, opportunities, free food. Home is a home option. Campaign, if you want to advertise for your website, for your products on Google, then you will choose this option. But you have some you have uh, some opportunities by using Google AdWords you can know from this one and you can uh, know also refers what you have uh, already um, 
given the ads uh, in Google then I will get all the reports here then if you I actually I'm going to use my Google Edward planner tool so how you can get this one okay don't worry I'm here to help you so no need to worry about anything because I will give you a step by step every every um, every helpful tutorial so just click on tools option then you will see there is no any um, research tool keyword research tool this is a keyword research so this is the alternative name of keyword research planner so that's why I'm going to click on keyword planner why do you need keyword planner keyword planner means if you want to make a website on any specific uh, on a specific any criteria or a specific any um, aim a specific business or any niche related business niche related blog then you have to research uh, what you have what kind of business do you, uh, are you going to do okay now I'm going to uh, charge any keywords from this here just click charge for new keywords just write your keyword name make website for free this is my keyword just click to get areas option if you don't have any area then you'll see this just modify this name wordpress tutorial for dot com yeah already I got this I want to make website using this keyword you have a already what is this one averagely this one 1 million means it's uh, 1 lakh visitors to 10 lakh visitors now 1 million means 10 lakh visitors to 1 crore visitors average monthly charts for this for like this areas okay now I am going to tell you something about from here WordPress tutorial this is the low competition so why what kind of how you can choose first to source follow the steps first low competition welcome recommended not welcome only recommended and middle medium median competition as well as good for ranking recommended to rank on Google easily but now I'll tell you medium got and high there is no high yeah this keyword is high competition WordPress training online okay um high means high competition this is very tough to get ranked on Google or others search engine okay now I'm not going to use high competition keyword I will use low competition keyword so how you can choose 
then look at search volume if you have a good amount of search volume then you will search this keyword in here i got one keyword which has a lots of search volume wordpress tutorial okay how to use wordpress i will use this one how to use wordpress because it has a lots of search volume 10k to 100k this uh, i'm just using this one this is my name keyword name not good to ever small the charge monthly charts competition low then suggest repeat the 1.65 dollar actually if you have a bit if you have a big uh, good suggested bit amount then you will choose this also but at first you have to uh, think if you uh, do do you have low competition this uh, this is a low competition uh, keyword or high competition keyword or medium competition if as well as it is a low competition keyword and also it has a very small the charts 10k to 100k okay i have got my idea so now i'm going to uh, i'm going to create my website so number three making website not making teaching creating website or blog or portfolio by using wordpress.com not dot words we are going to use this one just fast and go if you don't have any account on wordpress.com you have to make one so now i'm going to make uh, uh, when i'm going to make a account in here so just again going to click start uh, click on get a started button this is a free to use you can uh, to, you can find one option which is free for you and you can also free to uh, this you can use this uh, free for lifetime you don't need to uh, you don't need to <coughs> charge you don't need to pay any amount of money by using this platform to make website for free lifetime so uh, it has a some uh, it has a some uh, samples before creating new website so step one i am on step one so if you want to create a blog then you can click this option if you want to uh, create a new website then you can create this option okay then if you want to make an online store then you can click this one you can click this one this is very important if you want to create a portfolio okay just uh, i am going to uh, actually uh, in here in this tutorial i am going to make a blog site so uh, just click on start with the blog you have a, you have got you will find lots of um, theme you can uh, choose from this one so i'm i'm going to use simple uh, simple uh, actually simple 
okay library and just okay this one i'm going to pick this name so now i am going to use my keyword as well as i have got how to use wordpress just just i'm going to delete my speech how to use wordpress now uh, it's uh, charging uh, if you have uh, like this uh, due to uh, like this option then you will show this one but i have got just change the name okay how to use wordpress 24.wordpress.com this is a free to use as well as i'm going to uh, make this website for free that's why i'm going to click this option what is uh, shown uh, free just click to select option now you have a uh, four plans four plan a step four in a step four you have four plan but uh, i will use only free option best for a student as well as i am a student or as well as i am not going to fair i'm i'm not ready to fair any amount to create website so i will skip the uh, skip those three option but i will accept first one because it has only zero dollar investment for a lifetime but if you want to use if you want to um invest for any amount then you will option you will choose this one if you have a good budget then you will uh, choose this one if you have a good business with this blog then you will choose this one as well as i am a beginner level user that's why i am going to use this one okay just click on start with free now i am going to use my email address already we have made one okay first it then this is my username this is my first word this username isn't available here so i have to use my another email another username just paste it now i am going to um save this one save that information um this is the email address this is the username this is the first word of my blog my website then click to continue button already i have completed all the steps all five steps successfully now i have got a message thanks for waiting we are ready for you to get started okay we got a good um, sign uh, to make in website to start uh, to start customization customizing website so already we have a got message we have a send message please use this time to come from your to start this one at first you have to go there you go to your email address so now i'm going to click my i'm going to activate my account activate my um wordpress.com account so now click on confirm now i'm just going to delete this one because i will use from here i'm going to you okay just uh, use the demo where is it if you want to customize your website then you have to choose this one the next one 
this is my website this is my website uh, logo this is my menu bar this is my first content this is my sidebar this is my social icon this is my source button this is my widget this is my footer option okay just i'm going to um, publish some uh, actually um, some post okay lorem if jump I'm just going to uh, change my website address if you want to change your website address just how can you do it first I'm going to click on the customize option if you want to um, use if you want to change your identity of your website then you have to click on the site identity option at first uh, if, if you don't want to uh, use a change from this here then you are also edit this site from this pencil button fan button okay I'm just going to write my keyword is my keyword how to use WordPress how to use WordPress 24 this is my website name and uh, this is my title very helpful premium tutorial on wordpress.com or watch okay uh, if you want to display your site title or tagline then you can uh, check this option if you don't want to uh, if you want to hide this site title or tagline then you have to uncheck this option if you want to display the title or tagline then you have to check this option okay now uh, how you can change your site icon this is the site icon I don't want mm, to use this one so how to make your site icon at least uh, 500 uh, or 12 pixel width and what all so now uh, I'm going to charge site icon for WordPress create in Fabicon make free site icon easily okay I'm just going to um, create my site icon for my website I want to change this one actually I need to get I need to have to complete this one uh, for I need to have uh, some moments so I don't want to uh, spend more time so if you want to uh, spend more time then you can click one I just uh, I'm just going to use uh, from another way I'm just going to use this one
website icon website icon how you can change your site icon this is the site icon right now i'm just going to change my site icon select okay uh, where i have already saved that picture so i'm just going to select this one often <coughs> now click to select already I have changed my site icon okay then I want to change another things if you want to use any logo then you can choose this one and if you want to use your uh, is your I just want to use this one what powered by wordpress.com this one it's already changed now going to click on uh, no no need then color and backgrounds if you want to change your color and backgrounds I don't want to Phillips, Phillips, please. I just don't want to this one. Want to change this color? Okay. Color and backgrounds. Then fonts. If you want to change your font, then you can use this one. I'm not going to uh, change my change my font. What I have default, that I'll choose this one. And hidden image. What is the hidden image? If you want to use any hidden image in here, then you can choose in here default hidden image. Some hidden image available. If you want to add another hidden image, then you can choose one from add new option. What I'm going to use from from here. This is my hidden image. This is my hidden image also. But I will use this one now I'm going to change my menu bar I have already three menu here home about contact I want to add some menu in here how you can do it so I'll tell you something here about primary menu and social media menu what is the primary menu this is the primary menu actually and what is the social media menu social media menu this one now I'm going to change this one I want to add some items some menu items so how you can do it just click on items the right no need um fetch make a new face block privacy okay i have already i've already uh, created three uh, two items in menu bar in the primary menu bar but now I will uh, change that
I want to dark I want to use privacy block contact I want to con uh, set up this contact at the end of this menu bar so how you can do it just drag just drag here okay if you want to add any menu bar then you can use this one about sub menu if you want to create a sub menu then you can drag here then now I have got a sub menu I have got a sub menu okay now display location okay header in the header option what I have already uh, what we have already created okay social media menu I want to use my social media icon now back again I'm going to set up my social media link if you want to add any social media link and social media button how you can do it I have already four social media link so I am um, missing uh, one of my social favorite social media sites is missing right now which one Google Plus just write plus dot Google I want to use this one how you can add this just click on add items display location add items mm. Plus Google Plus Oh, this is not one Okay, I have created two items with same name. I'm just going to remove this one. Now, I'm just going to change this one. In social media menu if you want to make a, you have a full social media links so if you want if you have any another social media link then you can add how you can add just click on item and write your custom link plus dot Google plus click to admin you can drag here and there I'm just going to okay 
don't you don't need to um, set up any icon so icon will be uh, snipped snipped from server when you uh, use uh, uh, when you use the home uh, URL home face URL of the uh, social media website so don't worry to set up any icon for this website now I am going to back already I have set up my uh, this uh, primary menu and social media menu now I am going to use my content option if you want to use full content what is the full content do you know Still. just write again you see full content is available here so now I'm going to first extract extract I don't want to use my full don't want to show my full um, content here I want to hide that content so if you want to display if you want to first uh, if you want to display date then check this option if you want to display category then you can check this option okay I don't want to use this this author. I want to hide the author who has written the blog. You can. I just already uncheck this option. Okay. Now uh, display on single post. Display on pages. Featured image. You can uh, use your featured image. Display on a single post. Display. Um, typically use first image in post. okay now I am going to back again now I'm going to visit use my widget I don't want to use this right now the latest post if you want to set up your front page that means if anybody uh, if anybody uh, visit your website then you will what at first uh, which uh, display will show to him or her then you can choose you can set up the specific page I want to show my blog in, in my front page I want to as uh, um, post page I want to show my some blog post here Mm, this one front page block no need to actually I want to use the latest post okay after done that uh, customization uh, successfully customization uh, customization for your WordPress then you can click on save and publish now let's check again okay already has been changed this one now I am going to first how to uh, now I'm going to tell uh, show you that how to first uh, how to publish your first here okay just going to back back again click to my site and click to I'm now tell I'm not going to show you how to publish your first here okay then what is lorem I just want to use this one this is the get okay I'm not going to write 
now I'm just going to write my title of my post if you want to uh, use any uh, image then you can click on here I just want to use this and now I'm going to um, already I have a edited already I have added the email, email address if you want to uh, make anchor text then click on here and write just often if you want to uh, if anybody click on this um, button on this text then uh, it uh, uh, of uh, this link will often in a new tab or new window okay now I'm going to uh, click on stress not a, I just I'm, I'm just going to set up my category and just write WordPress tutorial okay this is the tutorial category you can also multiple category at WordPress tips okay I have already set up my category and text now I am going to already have set up my category then now I am going to text or keywords the text is very important why if you have a good text good uh, long tail keyword then you will your site will be ranked I um, just write how to use WordPress this is my text if you want to add more text then write comma now tutorial now I want to add another text then write comma then uh, tips and tricks of of comma okay this is my text and if you want to set up in if you want to set up any featured images what is called feature image do you know featured image I'm just uh, I'm just uh, I am going to show you see you live 20pro.com in this uh, this is called feature image this is called feature image so I want to set up feature image just click on here the right here and add new and set up from here okay then click to set featured image sharing okay everything is okay right now now I want to publish this one just click on publish before publishing this uh, post then you can also check your preview option how looks it actually now already I have published my content so I'm going to refresh my website how loads it now now I am going going to add widget how you can add widget I was just want to go there click on customize option click on yeah this content is right now this is the featured image now I am going to set up my widget 
in sidebar charts text widget i want to i don't want to use this one i just write want to edit this one about us this may about us page now if you want to add more widget widget then click on add widget i want to add Okay, use your uh, set of your categories option. Keywords. How looks it? Uh, okay, this one. If you want to display the drop down, then you can select this one. Then it will uh, be like this one. Okay now i am going to publish this publish this publish this one so i hope that anyone can make anyone can make a blog site blog website then uh, you can follow my instruction already we have uh, created blog some i want to add some edit, uh, widget mm, just write at widget and contact okay write your name google map api you can also publish check again this one this is the my this is our contact details okay with map already we have got map and now i am going to add another as a widget facebook page plugin if you want to set up your if you want to add your facebook page connect with fb Facebook page is HTTP Facebook dot com okay then if you want to use show your page or show cover photo then you can choose this one now another one I want to okay this is okay I don't want to add more here if you want to add your each any video from YouTube then you can choose this one I'm just uh, gone now some issue I have a um, popular ranked some ranked video here XML issue okay this is my tutorial now blogger perfect i just want to use insert if you want to if you don't want to upload any video then you can skip this option 
if you want to add any uh, video from your YouTube then just write you a uh, copy your copy your video URL insert form right here then already I have got this one okay just click on add to gadget you can also edit this one okay no need to edit already I have um, I've successfully uh, done that option now let's check again after done this then you have to click on save and publish now refresh this one okay we have successfully created our blog uh, this blog is very responsive we have a set of our header option we have a set of word header option main title um, tagline menu bar and header image and first and social media button charts button about us widget and our uh, category and site map or contact details and also we have a set of uh, already added our um, facebook face and blogger uh, and uh, already we have uh, added our um, youtube video so this blog is very good and responsive this is the first how you can check your responsive check it again this is responsive check this one all menu is available here the right check this one so uh, if you have any question uh, to make uh, to create like this website or if you want to get more tutorial on another platform or in another customization uh, themes so let me know let me um, so uh, try to make a comment uh, on uh, description of my video so i'll try my best to help you to uh, by um, creating by sharing my knowledge uh, uh, free for you okay uh, goodbye